This video shows how to use Rosepoint ECS to upload the overall vessel and tow dimensions, length and width, to the vessel's AIS transponder. That's the overall length of the tow and the vessel combined. For this to work, you'll need three things. First, the connection between the PC and the AIS transponder must have the right cable, one that allows bi-directional communication. In addition to allowing the PC to receive data from the transponder, the cabling has to allow data to flow from the PC to the transponder. Second, the transponder needs to be configured to receive data as well as send data on the port the cable is connected to. And third, any password issues that restrict access that prevent changing settings on the AIS transponder must be addressed. To begin, Click the main menu in the upper left-hand corner and select Configure Vessel and Electronics. In the configuration list, select AIS Transponder. Note, you'll need to know the location of the antenna, its distance from the bow, stern, and port and starboard sides of your vessel. We want to enter the combined distance from the position of the AIS antenna on the vessel to the front of the tow. In this example, the AIS antenna is 30 feet from the bow of the vessel, and the tow is 600 feet in front of that, so it's 630 feet from the antenna on the vessel to the very head of the tow. So I'll enter that here in the box labeled distance from bow. I'll change 30 feet to 630 feet. The distance from the AIS antenna to the stern of the vessel is unchanged, so I don't need to change distance from stern. The tow is 100 feet wide, and the antenna is in the middle of the vessel in this example, so it's 50 feet from the port side and 50 feet from the starboard side, so I'll replace the 25 feet here with 50 feet, and I'll replace that with 50 feet. Note, if your AIS transponder antenna has a significant offset to port or starboard, these dimensions will need to be adjusted for that offset. Now I'll click Send to AIS Transponder to upload the new settings to the transponder. Because different AIS units upload differently, you won't receive any acknowledgement here. And I'll click OK to close this window. And we're done. Thanks for watching.